Um, and yeah, that's that's. I will continue to do pay to win charity streams. <laughs> that's I will I will always do that. Yes. Okay. Oh, now that's a cool idea. You know, we could probably do that too. Donation goals that unlock cosmetics for everyone. We absolutely could do that. We could have donation goals during charity streams where when we hit the goal, everyone watching at that moment gets a custom Kovatar thing. Yeah, that's that's absolutely something we could do. But we could also do a one for direct donations as well. So we could do everything. We could do all of it. <laughs> so we'll see. We'll see. All the things, chat. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're going to put... What the hell is that sound? Does someone have a mining platform up? Oh, it's the it's my drill. Oh, look at that! I just switched weapons, and yeah, it stopped. I I haven't had that before. I only got the drill today. Interesting. Okay, thank you. Good to know. Good to know. Mm -mm. Okay, so all of our guys are doing their things. We are doing all of our things. Uh, let me do this real quick. Uh, hell, I'm stuck. There we go. Um, boop. So I don't know what these things are worth. Um, what do you guys think, chat? What do you think these are worth? These are these are not the end tier. They're only the middle tier. Five hundred. Think so? Oh, we can item exchange. Is this every item in the game? Oh my god. That's kind of wild. Huh. That's interesting. Um, okay, so what do you what do you guys think? 500? Oh, acid! That's a great idea. Yeah. So we can act, wait, can I, oh, oh, we can search. Look at that. They put in a search function that doesn't work. Nope, there it is. Okay, good. <laughs> um, what, 25 acid a piece? Sure. That seems fine. That seems pretty good. Look at this. It remembered my previous setting. That's so handy. There's a lot of great QOL in this game, dude. All right, we'll see if that sells. I don't know if it will. We'll see. Okay, let's go try this quest. Julia! Co, you can place a mirror and change hairstyle for free. In furniture's furnishing items, floor furniture, you should have it Co, Julia. Awesome! Thank you, Julia. I did not realize you could do that. That's great. Thank you, thank you. Uh, what this? Okay, good talk. It's nothing, just some, you know. Seeing as you know who I am, you should know not to try to fool me. Okay, okay, just don't hurt me, alright? I was merely sent here to collect data on the Stardust Diffuser settings. That's them, the devices, devices used to collect Stardust. It releases a collected Stardust when it detects nearby human activity. All I know is, is is that it's part of some top secret project. With how low my position is, there's no way to let me in any of the details. Do you know how much Stardust contamination this will cause? I have no choice. If I refuse, I die, and the others would still come to investigate the diffuser. Listen, I'm just following orders, so don't kill me, all right? I'm begging you to let me go. Yeah, sure, go ahead. I have a better idea. I can give you a tracker, and once we've installed the diffuser, we can use it to locate you. Including the one I just handled, there are three in total within my assigned area, and they're all well hidden. Okay. Away with you. All right, I'm out of here. Oh, this writing. Okay. Uh, that is closed. Okay. 
I guess we're doing this. Let's go. This is all our tier as well, so we need to be looting everything here. Because we're going to need a ton of resources. For our T4, T5 stuff. Did that not work? Oh, there he is. I don't know if I can use my deviance in this lag. He doesn't seem to be firing off or anything. I may want to uh, go to a different zone since we're doing a lot of fighting and stuff now. Yeah, I think I'm going to want to do that. Oh, Lord. Something weird is going on, man. I want that sound, and I want it to be my phone notification whenever someone sends me a message. The game feels repetitive a bit after some point. You are just... Nah. Does this game feel repetitive after some point? Yeah, after about the first 30 minutes. It's pretty much all the same thing. It's, it's a farming looter shooter kind of game. So, I mean, does the game feel repetitive? Absolutely. But... The cool thing about it is that it keeps adding new things. So it's like, and it gives you most importantly, lots of long-term goals. And I think that's the most important thing, at least for me. Like, you know, if you think of like an MMO, MMO gameplay is boring 90% of the time. I mean, especially the MMOs I used to play, like EverQuest and Dark Age of Camelot and stuff. Boring as hell. However, it was some of the most entertaining and engaging games I've ever played. So you would ask yourself, why are some of your favorite games some of the most boring? And that's because those games have this wonderful thing about investing you in them for long-term goals. So you're not playing through that boring grind or that boring farm because you, you know, you're having a great time at that moment. You're playing because you can't wait to go raid with your guildies at the end game, or you can't wait to get that great item that's going to drop, or you can't wait to finish your build or that set that you're working on. And that is what keeps you playing through the re the, rep re the repetitive gameplay. That's what keeps you in. This game does a great job of giving you lots of long-term goals. It does that well. So it does a good job at like teasing you in build things, uh, teasing you through the tiers. Um, the way that it does power progression, you start unlocking more and more like powerful mechanics as you keep going. The gameplay itself doesn't really change. You're doing the same thing the whole time but it's a numbers go up situation. And when you become invested in those numbers going up, everything becomes more fun. So that's the big thing. The game does a good job of getting you invested in the numbers go up. And when you get invested in that, then everything becomes more enjoyable because you're more invested in it. So it has more value to you. Yep. So anyway, that's to answer, to go back to the guy's commentary saying this game is repetitive. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> I'm loving it. Mm -hmm. Some games are repetitive and they don't establish long-term goals. And those are the games I play for a couple hours and then never play again. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. It Dolan says, aren't most games repetitive? Yeah, absolutely. There's a reason they call it a gameplay loop <laughs> and not a gameplay line. <laughs> and I'm going to trademark that. No Carnage Industries 2024. Yep. Okay. Uh, I don't see any deviations out here, but we'll grab all these for the seeds and stuff. Uh, Ramaset. Been watching on YouTube for hundreds of hours. Homesick. Thought I'd stop by and drop off a prime sub. Thank Thanks you, dude. Content. Very much appreciate that. Thank you, Ramaset, and uh, thanks for stopping by from YouTube, dude. We appreciate it. 
And somebody said, isn't he really close to being out of ammo? Yes. And I probably should have addressed that before I left. But here we are. So we'll switch over to our other guy. Man, the houses over here look really nice. I will say it's also been very cool in this game. The higher tier you get to, the more and more houses become actual try-hard houses. And it's gotten to the point now where like everywhere I go is just try-hard houses. And it's awesome. Like it's really cool seeing everyone like spending time on the building system. Uh, it's a very cool system that offers a lot of, of very, very fun construction options. Yeah, seeing people take advantage of that's been very cool. What are try-hard houses? Try-hard houses are houses that people actually try to make fun and interesting and not just a flat piece of wood foundations with the necessary crafting materials on it. So they are, they are try-harding, making something cool and interesting is a good way to think about it. Also, this guy is, that's my exact house. Wait, that is my house. Never mind. <clears throat> I was gonna be like, that guy copied my house. Oh wait, that okay. We're good. <clears throat> oh, how nice of that guy. I was like, I wonder if I'm about to die. No, oh, turned out we're good. Nice. I know that guy has no creativity over there. His house looks like a box. Oh wait, that's my house. That house is great. How creative and awesome. Oh, dude, is this guy's house under attack? What's going on here? Bro, get off that guy's house. What are you doing? You jerk. I think that guy's trying to stop it, too. Oh, oh, there we go, there we go. We got it. Casual walking bus. Nice. Always great stuff in the bus box. All right, let's go. Uh oh. Ooh. What this? Oh God. Oh. Have you learned to make bread yet? Would be cool to see a bit of dough carnage. No. Um. Okay. Either someone else was sniping them or I don't know what was going on, but going on here song goes but okay um Okay. Do they sound different?
blue, orange, yellow. That took me longer than it should have. I was like, why do they sound the same? If sound, it, I mean, that would mean sound has nothing to do. Oh. Well, we got there, Chad. We got there. We got there. Just took us some time. Okay, let's go. Mm, oh. Boy, that was a hard puzzle. Oh, shit. Triangle grip. Okay, cool. Love getting that stuff. Uh, where's the third? There it is. Let's go. Uh, this guy takes his defense very seriously. Wow. Dude, how does he even power all this? This is a freaking compound. I love it. I love how he has a turret in like every single yeah, direction. Around, so shoot deers. Oh, the turret shoot deers? Is that why? Yeah, That's kind of Could be. Yeah. Have freaking uh, rawhide for days, right? I will say these houses have given me a lot of ideas for our next season house. Whatever that may be or whatever it looks like. I really like the idea of making like a large foundation and then building a house on that foundation that's not necessarily on the outside of it. I, re I, I really like that. That's pretty cool. We may actually do something with that in our current build. We'll see. Ooh. Deviated wheat. Cool. Set up that way. Oops. Sorry, guys. A deer and a knife. Gotta be careful. That guy let. Wait, did he make it? Did he leave a trap for us here? I can't okay. I'm gonna end that guy. Yeah. I'm gonna end him so hard. Mm-hmm. Got this. Wow. A lot of good food stuff in there. I got a Roomba! Port to Andres. Okay. Looking good there. And that's back at camp. Perfect. Oh, what's this? That guy was just doing stuff here. Wait, what? Oh, 
<laughs> that's the sound. Oh god, that's crazy. I love it. Thank you. American coffee table? That is so freedom. Um a riot shield. Damn. Okay. What am I doing here? Investigate the room and figure out the birthday date. Pick up number six. Okay. Place the right numbers on the wall. Open loot crate by Happy Lee Liz. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to my dear. Happy birthday to you. That's, that was a little creepy. Um, obliterate violent. Oh, go on. We got a bunch of shrapnel mods. What is it? What is it? Oh, is it a... After accumulating two kills, refill 80% of your magazine? Damn. So wait, where do, uh, where is this thing? Oh, 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 they're called obliterate. That's what it is. These are obliterate. Okay. Okay. Cool. Hmm. Did you hear that? Okay. Cool, cool. Um, we have like two different things to turn in there now. Let's go see what that is. Oh, actually, let's go back and make some ammo first, and then we'll go. Then we'll go there and see what that is. Yep. Make some shoes. Oh, I want to get a shrapnel gun, big time. Mm-hmm. That'd be nice. I think that gold, uh, that gold gun we were looking at is shrapnel. <clears throat> have I been shooting for all side quest content? We have done a lot of side quests, but we haven't done all of them. Not, not yet. I may actually, like, do them over time. Um, oh, yeah, look at that. I haven't I haven't fully decided what we're going to do with all the side quests. Depends on if it's kind of, like, worth it and if the reasons. I think there were, but I don't know if there still are. So we'll, we'll see. Medium garage. Excuse me, sir. Can I trouble you for a moment? Uh, oh, oh, oh. what's up, dude? How can I help you? Do you have any of those, uh, backpack or backpack mods, like the ones that, like, do, like, water filtration and stuff? Uh, the backpack mods I have are over on that vending machine. I only have one right now, unfortunately. It's the one that makes it so, uh, gravel and ore and wood is reduced weight in your pack. Awesome. Thank you. Yep. So we may have to redo this whole thing. If I want to keep it like this, which I may not. We can move those lights too. Let's take a look here. Oh, turbo pickup. Wait, this isn't what I want. No, I, I wanted to make the cars. Oh, is that for a large garage? Hold on. Where's it in here? No. Press X. Oh. Oh, damn. Uh, okay. Cool. 
Cool. Wait, front bumper guard? What's this stuff? Special pla- Oh, and tungsten. You're uh, all sold out. I appreciate it, though. Have a great one. Oh, yeah. Uh, actually, hey, dude. Wait, I'm sold out? Really? Uh, I can make one for you if you want. Let me go take a look. I think I just need the basic thing. Let me check real quick. Wait, I'm sold out? Y'all bought all my things? That was quick. I think you never did that. Can I see who did it and stuff? Hey, here we go. Oh, no, that's... that's. Uh, I need... So, I can make uh, the T2 with carbon fiber fabric or for 18 of those or uh, the highest version for 30 bulletproof fabric. I don't know if you actually came in to hear that. I don't know if I have any of that, so just uh Oh, right on man. Yep, best of luck to you, dude. Okay, that works. Thank you, man. Have a good one. You too. That's cool. That dude is just going around and like looking for different uh looking for different things. That's kind of fun. I think I'm gonna uh break that down for now. We're going to have to redo this whole garage thing. I don't think it's going to quite work how I was ex wanting it to. But that's fine. That's okay. Um, out here. We could make a larger garage. We could also make a second garage. Oh, I'm getting ideas. I'm getting ideas. Hold on. I'll have to think about that. Okay, no, I'm gonna have to think about that. <laughs> we'll see. How do you unlock glass? Money, buddy. Uh, that's the the money version. Yep. Good. Just build a parking garage. Actually, considering it, I might do just that. Actually. The reason I'm doing this is not because it looks ridiculous, which it does, don't get me wrong. The reason I'm doing this is because I want to build a second structure out here. But I want to make sure it is going to properly sync if we ever decide to connect it later to our base. So now that we have a perfect stair up here, this is the exact same level as that floor. So we could do some really fun stuff with that later if we wanted to. Mm -hmm. And now it would all sink in and connect perfectly as well. I deserve that. I did. Press F to respawn. F. Uh, there we go. <clears throat> so about that ammo. Yeah, no, right? About about that ammo. About that ammo. Yeah. About that thing you said. Okay. F to pay respects, chat. That's right. F to pay respects. Oh, 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 oh. Bam. We got it, chat. We got there.
don't know if this is going to be enough. I love so much that they made lights not need power. That's one of those things where it's just like, you know what? Yeah, it's a little bit less realistic, but it's that's just better. Yeah, it's just better. It's just a good decision. Oh, I'm out of locks. All right, we still need to get uh, more memetics. How many memetics do we have? Four. Is that enough for the ammo that we need to make these turrets? Is this steel? It is. No, we need five, because of course we need five. We gotta go cut down a bunch of trees. We'll do that right after lunch! Ah, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me this morning. I hope you had a good time. I know I did. We got a huge amount done, and this afternoon we're gonna get back, and we're just gonna start doing a whole lot of combat. Today was like a lot of building, and we kind of, we got the beaver, we got the frog, we got the bunny. We did like a lot of um, stuff that I'd normally save for like end game. I, I did a lot of that today, this morning, which was, was very fun, because now our base is looking badass, and, and we got a lot of time to enjoy it, so, yeah. On that note, I'm going to go for now when I get back uh, in about an hour or so. We're going to raid over to my alt channel, slash co. You can hang out there and watch reruns with the old, uh, with the with the regulars if you want. Then when I get back, we're going to raid back to here, and, uh, and we'll pick up from there. And like I said, this afternoon is going to be mostly main story. I do really want to make a push to T5, because I want to do, I want to get our base to our, like, final area where all the T5 stuff is. And then I want to start like really doing farming. So I've, I've been kind of holding back doing that because we're not there yet. So anyway, we'll start working on that this afternoon. And I hope to see you here because it should be fun. All right, friends, I'm out of here for now. Have a great rest of your day. Thank you for watching and uh, see y'all in just about an hour or so. Bye-bye.